Hey, hello, my name is Gustavo Ferrari. I am from Buenos Aires, Argentina. I, I arrived yesterday to okay. London yeah. to attend this meeting and then I'm also going to stay like uh, three more weeks in Europe. Oh, beautiful. Also teaching workshops and making conference about our art okay. in Berlin and Brussels. Wow. Mm. And what is so special about the Letterheads gatherings? Well, I, I really like the Letterheads gatherings because it's a place where you share, you share the trade, but you also share friendship. And it's amazing because it gathers people from all over the world and you just spend a, a full weekend with friends. Fantastic. That's, that's the best thing for me. Yeah. And so how did you get into the whole sign writing Well, art? The, the style that I do is, uh, is called fileteado porteño. It's a specific style of decorative painting and sign painting from Argentina. It's a style that is uh, traditional from the country and was declared World Cultural Heritage by UNESCO wow. in 2015. So I started to learn the style in 2001 when I was 18 years old. And then after taking classes for a year, my teacher asked me to help him. So it became my work and I'm still here 23 years after, <laughs> wow. traveling around the world and showcasing our, it's part of our culture, no? Okay. And it's super amazing to have this chance of uh, showcase this to other people in the world. Yeah, yeah. So can you just show us a bit about this particular yeah, style sure. and technique? So here you have like a, a traditional work. The, the fileteado style has mostly scroll works and acanthus leaves. And it has different elements like the acanthus, the round flowers, the bell flowers, and the flags. So it's a fully ornamented style. It also has letters. And then at some point you can also paint some uh, pictorials. In this case, this is a work made with me, by me and my wife. Okay. So my wife painted the pictorial and I did all the scroll work around. And it's a style that started around 120 years ago in Argentina as a decoration on the horse carts of the fruit sellers, the people who deliver milk, bread, vegetables. Then it passed to the buses and the trucks. And now it's everywhere in the city, in shop windows, uh, signs, murals. So it's uh, quite a traditional style for Argentina. And you said it's, it's, it's got a protected characteristic. You said it's, it's uh, United Nations protected it's a World Cultural Heritage. World Cultural Heritage. Yeah. So that's, by, by UNESCO. So that's quite an unusual thing, is it? To have a, an artistic style protected yeah, in that yeah. way. I mean, they have different uh, cultural items, let's say. So there's music, there is different practices from different towns and peoples from all the world. So Argentina has three. One is the style of the fileteado. The other one is the tango. And the <laughs> other one is the chamamé, which is another kind of music from the northeast of Argentina. So those are the three uh, cultural items that are World Cultural Heritage. Okay. And so part of your reason for being here is to also showcase this style and to pass on of to course. pass on the technique. And make it more known around the world. That's yeah, one yeah. of our missions, let's say. Okay, okay. Yeah. And so will you be doing some... Are you doing workshops today or demonstrating? I, I will be here specifically okay. doing a full weekend demonstration. So that's what Pete asked me. So people can come. I will explain what I'm doing, show different parts of the step and step by the wall of oh, the work. Fantastic. Because we work on layers. So we have flat color, then shadows, then lights and highlights to make the volume and the deepness. So that's the idea to be showing this, uh, the whole process. Fantastic. That's great.